Hi, welcome to Panda 2 Getting Started tutorial. In this tutorial, you will get a short overview on how to start working with Panda 2. First, you need to create a new project. Do it by clicking on the New Project button. A pop-up window will ask you to select a folder where you want to place your project. Next, enter your name for your project and click OK. Once your project is loaded, you will see the main user interface. On the left is the sidebar, next is the code editor, and at the right is the game view. Your game will be made from classes, so first, we should create one. Go to the empty line number 12 and click on the small plus button on the bottom right of the sidebar. A bunch of code will appear from nowhere. Now, you can name your class. The cursor will already be at the right place, so just go ahead and type. Next, click on the Save button, and your new class will appear on the sidebar. Next, we need some assets. Your new project comes with one asset. If you click on the Assets button, you can see files named panda.png on the sidebar. Click on the Assets button again to switch back to Classes view. In order to use that asset, we need to first load it. Now, the file panda.png will be loaded. Let's use that file in your class. Now your class will have a variable called sprite that contains instances of the sprite class, which uses panda.png as a texture. Now that you have your class ready, it's time to use it. In your main scenes init function, create a new instance of your class. We still need to add the sprite to the stage. Click on the Save button, and now you should see your sprite on the left top corner. That's it! Thanks for watching, and happy coding!